Hi everyone, I'm Chris, and I'm at BET Conference, the world's leading edtech show. I'm going to take you on a tour of all the cool things here today. Let's go. Apps continue to be a big trend. This one's called Gleam. It helps learners record lessons, take notes, and bookmark key information or tasks. It's really convenient and helps them stay in the moment in lessons when it matters most. Look who it is! We have loads of great things on the stand, but my favorite is the Oxford Test of English. Adaptive tests change their difficulty to match the test taker. They're a great way to combat cheating, and they're shorter, more motivating, and more precise too. Everyone's talking about AI at the moment. Which side of the debate are you on? Century are using it to automate marking, save teachers time, and help learners prepare for assessment more effectively. Okay, I'm kind of just scoring easy goals here. I've got no one against me. We've seen loads of augmented reality and gamification today, but we haven't seen many people combine it with English teaching. How do you think it would work in your classroom? So I'm stood at the top of a skyscraper and there's this really wobbly plank there making me walk across to get to the other side. Oh no. Oh, I'm like a thousand feet up. This is bad. This is very bad. Oh no, no! <laughs> yeah, I, I, I just, I just hit the, I hit the concrete. That, that didn't go well. I've had loads of fun here today. My favourite bit was definitely the VR headset. But looking around, it's really clear that even the most amazing new technology can improve education without the right teacher behind it. Over to you. Can you imagine augmented reality built into your classroom? Will AI improve education or will it make it worse? Let us know what you think.